Part seven is gonna be now short. That was a right old conflagration. Don't think they'll be chasing after us anytime soon. You certainly didn't leave them much of a port, though. I wonder if the town will ever recover. How much did you tell them? I had just started episode two, Moggy Lou's Fury, wherein the beautiful witch is captured and tortured by a demon most cruel. I'm starting to see why they wanted to execute you. Yes, exactly my point. All right, cutscene. Velvet, how's our heading? This is so hard to read. Good point, bitch! Actually, you're holding it wrong. It's built to function even if the ship is rolling. <sighs> Velvet! Stop it, gone. bitch! Roko is pissed. Kid, what's your name? Number two. Not that. Your real name. Surely you have one. Wanna hold it? Uh, if that's an order... I'm asking you what you want. So you're ordering me to answer? Uh, right, right. You Malakim would destroy yourselves as long as it was an order, wouldn't you? That is our purpose. You really are tools. In that case, keep your mouth shut. <laughs> Cannon fire astern! Pirates! That flag, it's got to be High Fleet's pirate crew! They've got a bead on us, folks! And in case you hadn't noticed, we aren't really equipped for sea combat! Well, oh, shit, Sean! To land, then! We can fight them there! Yeah! Woo! We get Aizen! We get fucking Aizen! I wanted to do this Aizen in the last part, but some people kept fucking messaging me! Look at that. They really are a bunch of demons. That works in our favor. You knowingly pick fights with demons? Must have a death wish. Yes, they do. Now that we're on land. Wipe them out, number two. That's an order. Whoa there. We're not the one you'll be fighting. Hey, Aizen! I love Aizen. Aizen's like a badass. I said, motherfuckers! Me. A Moloch? No. I'm the Reaper. I'm the Reaper. Let's go, hold up! What is this guy? A Moloch pirate? He's a fucking jackass! Twin blades. No pendulum that I can see. Hold up! How's that? See this? Ah, Bison. Keep them distracted, bitches. Man, Rukuro gets his ass kicked every fucking day. There we go, we don't have to deal with them. You passed the test. Join us. Why? Aren't you the impudent one? Says the demon who torched Televis. You knew about that? I hope you realize we're doing you a favor. If you'd stayed on that course, you would have smashed right up against the gate of Vortigern. You guys are headed for Midgand, aren't you? That means you're gonna have to go through the Narrows up ahead. But the kingdom has a massive fortress there built to defend them, with a tremendous gate. Damn! A 
fortress. If this is true, we're in your debt. We desire to pass through as well, but we lack the strength. I propose we form a partnership. That last forever! <laughs> Do you really want to see the gate for yourself? We won't stop you. We'll even throw you a nice funeral if you like. Shot fire! I know what I said. He's a jackass. So what? We're allowed to refuse? Your business is your business, and ours is ours. There's nothing more to say. He does have a point. But first mate, y you can't go alone. We'll all come with you. You'd only get in the way. Shut fire! And focus on your duties aboard the Von Eltia. This guy's a fucking genius! And stop the Phoenix! We didn't even beat the guy. The guy kicked our asses, man. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I fucking know! Alright. We lost the compass, by the way. Tragically, your favorite witch is neither a sailor nor a warrior. All she can really do is look on. No argument there. Is the gate of Vortigern really something that impressive, Dial? They've got a fortress and a patrolling fleet, but the gate is the real show. Even a battleship couldn't blast its way through that thing. Shit! Is there no sea route that avoids the narrows? There is, so to speak, but it's a long way out into the open sea. We just end up shipwrecked. <laughs> Of course we will, because we're fucking geniuses! So to speak. And what are you folks planning anyway? Like I said, we're getting through that gate. If you're not helping us, then the conversation's over. Is it possible to get through? If the first mate says he'll do it, he'll do it. You sure put a lot of faith in him. He's a Moloch, isn't he? That doesn't matter. He's got the captain's blessing, and that's enough for us. Couldn't you ignore the narrows and just sail around? Sail the road! People think I'm just a fucking clown! In an earlier attack. Compass? Hmm. Huh. But in the end, we're pirates. If someone blocks our way, we can't just fall back. And that's what makes a pirate, huh? The pirates share our goal. I don't think we have any choice but to band together. True enough! If forward lies so now we're a but now we're but teaming up with a bunch of fucking pirates. What the fuck is wrong with us? And yet you don't feel like helping out. I sure don't. Fuck you, bitch! That Moloch is all he seems. <laughs> Who knows what's up his sleeves? He's a pirate! Moloch too. Hey boy, you sense anything? Huh. We both have ulterior motives. In any case, let's go after him. All right, let's do this shit, motherfucker. Oh wait, no, there's still one more cutscene. Where the fuck is Dial? Hey, Dial. I know you probably won't listen to me, but you shouldn't get involved with Ifrit's pirates. Ifrit is the fiercest, most villainous pirate in all the seas. Yes. Every sailor trembles at his name. Yeah. Demon, you're pretty wimpy. Demon or not, scary is scary. So this Ifrit is that tough? You bet. Rumor has it he's an unrepentant troublemaker and is as strong as an ogre. His gang are all fearless, wild rogues. They've turned the tables on the Royal Navy time and time again. And best of all is their ship, the Von Eltia. She's a legend that's traveled to distant lands across the sea. Nice. Sounds like I'd get along with them just fine. You seem to Frank know partner, about bitches! <laughs> well, it's just that every sailor <laughs> I love Rogero. Rogero and Eisen are like crew. the best. I guess. Hey, I can dream, can't I? No! Even or human or even lizard, we all got our fantasies. We don't have any fantasies, bitch! Alright, saving. We are saving! Oh, there is a treasure chest up here. Earth ring. That's not useful to anyone because everyone doesn't have earth powers. All right, now we're getting into this area where I don't like whatsoever, but I will be training in this area to some extent. 
But there are some there. This is. We have to deal with fucking scorpions. I love scorpions. Scorpio's got nothing on this bitch. Is there anything over here? No, of course not. There's more cat things. And there's also spider. Well, no, is it spider? Yeah, we're. We have to deal with. Uh, what the fuck? There are fucking spiders and fucking. There are spiders and they are scorpions. What the fuck? So yeah, I'm gonna be training them, but we're gonna we're gonna get Isaac first before we start fighting these fucking things. Because oh yeah, there's also cactuses. Stop fucking falling for the fucking fucking. <laughs> oh wait. Until we get Isaac, I'm not gonna fight any of them. Because I'm gonna be training a lot in this area. Because these enemies are really fucking tough! So, you've chosen to trust a pirate? Yes! Not for a second. But if you're prepared to lend us the use of your ship and crew until we reach the capital, we'll help you. I'll agree to those terms. But there's something I should tell you first. I bring ill fortune to all those around me. The Reaper's Curse. The Reaper's Curse! I could flip this coin a thousand times and still land on tails. Trying to get through the fort cost the lives of five good sailors. Damn! If you join up with me, I can't guarantee your safety. Why would you go out of your way to warn us? Even demons don't want to meet an unfair death, right? If you still want to come with me, just know the risks. Works for me. I land on tails, I'll flip it to heads on my own. Your name? Velvet. This is number two. Hmm. I'm Rokuro. A pleasure. Aizen. Aizen! 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 Drunken You've partner! Got a plan of attack, I'm sure. Let's hear it. To put it bluntly, Vortigern is impregnable. It won't fall to an attack whether by sea or by land. Yes! So, no plan? No what? plan! What about both at once? Exactly. First, we send in the Von Eltia to draw their fleet out of the Narrows. Then we slip inside and open the Seagate ourselves. The Von Eltia will then break away and rush back into the channel. We'll climb aboard and push through. One slip and we're all as good as dead. Then don't slip and we're not dead. Ooh! Walking with the Reaper, huh? The plan is already in motion. Let's move. This cave leads to the fortress. Well, no shit, Shaw. Alright, so now we got Aizen. So now we got uh, our crew here. You got the mage, who is a fucking mage. Rokuro and Aizen. Aizen is really difficult. I've never been able to fight. I'll finish this quick. Yeah, but we have at least four people now. So that's good. Fuck you, spider! You got nothing on me, bitch! I'M THE FUCKING SPIDER KING! Woo! You got the devoured, bitches! Jesus Christ! Unarmed? Hardly. These are deadly weapons. Huh. What'll it take to make you go all out? Shots fired! Alright, um, let's continue on. We killed some fucking spiders, motherfuckers! Now, where the hell am I gonna go? Alright, this is a good training area. 
Um, I might do some training after we get to the end of this. So that way, because I know the next area. The next area is fucking dope. I rather keep the I rather keep the training to a minimum because uh, reasons. But I know there's a big giant enemy in this area, so we're gonna try to beat them on camera. We'll be seeing that item in, in later in the next game. By the way, but when it comes to Tales game, this is probably my second favorite. When it comes to the story mode. Um, Tales of Despair is number one because of, um, uh... Move it or die. <laughs> it's... I've been... I have more hours into that game than any other game of the Tales series ever. Yeah, fucking cactuses! Fucking die! <laughs> There's a lot of cactuses in this area. You won't get any pity or compassion from me. Of course you won't. Well, we got. Oh yeah, that's right. We got some items. Uh. Stop it with the freaking thing, my bobbers. Jesus Christ, people just don't know when to quit! Alright, we, we, we were just... People, stop fucking messaging me! Stop it with the fucking nicknames! Look at all these vines. They're too tangled to cut through. I'm carrying some flint. Just burn through it. Do you really think this is a good place for us to start a fire? Normally, no. But we're also demons and Malakim. Get what I'm saying? Yeah. We're not exactly normal ourselves. Alright, now we can try to light the thing up but like it's nothing! Nice job, bitches! Alright, now there's two areas here. I think this is where the enemy, big giant enemy is. I'm fucking lost! Ah, uh, they're having a good conversation. Well, I uh, this is gonna be the last part. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna go start training. There's I might go backwards and hope for the best. Um, I hope you guys have a nice positive day. I might start training a little bit better until we move on to the next one. I might go back and save it. Son of a bitch, did you? We have Eisen back, so it doesn't really bother us. Yeah, but if they're gonna keep messaging me, what's the point? See, I got, I gotta figure out how to fucking mute the fucking chat. Because I don't want them to like, but oh, son of a bitch, no, no. I'm going to be training a little bit, so next time I'll be leveling up a lot of my characters. So I hope you guys have a nice positive day, and take fucking care! Oh wait, let's pick up this thing. Can we at least go back outside? Probably not. Booyah, yeah, bitches! Alright. Hope you guys have a nice positive day, take fucking care! Sorry about the two parts being short. But, you know, I'm dealing with a lot of people talking to me at the same fucking time!